Okay, yeah. so, yeah. Um, thank you. So, <laughs> what, what actually is happening with cancelling of beliefs? Um, so, in truth, as the Course in Miracles says, in, in, in the truth, I mean, the, you could say this world is a world of illusions, or it's the world of separation and fear, uh, or the world of perception. So, and the, as the Course hints to throughout the lessons, once you start to go towards the truth, it's timeless, it's formless, it's eternal. We go to those, uh, or states of oneness, where there's the total elimination of fear and separation, uh, or, you, uh, or any, any form of um, duality. So, what, what am I doing? Well, let's say if I uh, cancel my belief in, uh, if I was to cancel my belief in kidney failure. If I was to cancel my belief in kidney failure, I'm an infinite being subject only to what I hold in mind. So what, I'm, what is that actually, I mean, how would I break that down, you know? Well, I don't think it really matters, you know, I cancel. I mean, the I, I guess, is relating to the infinite I, because uh, the infinite I has the power to, to relinquish my attachment to illusions, my attachment to fear and separation, or all the or all the um, constructed world created out of fear and separation. So, so it's like, I, I could, you know, it's cancel, so I cancel. It's like I'm no longer going to remember that if you identify, or what is, what is, what is a belief? Well, a belief for me, you know, what creates uh, the experiencing of separation is identification. And, uh, and I mean, I, I talk about this verbally, identification with thoughts or form or pictures and also, uh, to make it simple, repressed energies, repressed feelings. So these create, these create the karmic packages uh, which comprise the ego. So, so let's say kidney failure, um, now an aspect of kidney failure is the belief you know, and the belief, it's a belief system. So there'll be beliefs, you know, it's like a packaged belief. So there's a belief in uh, the kidneys are going to fail, the kidneys are a real thing that's supposed to be uh, part of my body, uh, there's all this thing, and all of that is like an identified karmic belief package in sort of like form. It's a belief in form that can be manifested in this world of separation. It comes out of the formless. So, and at, you know, in truth, like if we go to God unmanifest or into the realms of light, pre, pre manifestation, none of this exists. So there's just infinite light, love, and oneness be, before the uh, experiencing of separation, you know, the world of separation, fear, and me and you. It seems like there's a world of lots of me's and you's in separation to each other, which for me is an illusion if you're experiencing the Absolute, because in the Absolute uh, that can't be experienced, it's not real. You have to like identify with things like thoughts and belief systems and projections and collective projections to then experience a world of fear and separation and death and dying and illness and all of that. So, so I cancel that. I cancel my belief. So it's cancelling the whole package which is manifesting in the world of separation this form. You could say like a belief is a package of form. It's like a, if you had like you went to a cinema, there's just this, there's just the light and then you can put forward a film in front of the, the light which then creates the image on the screen and that those that image is like a is like a karmic belief, you know. Really, there's only light and truth, and as soon as you put a film on it, it's like the layers. You know, you can you can have like these characters that look like they're real, and they can be old or young or whatever, and that's like the karma which gets projected, and then is like the the perception of of separation and fear on the screen. So that's the, that's the belief system that creates the karma, that then creates the, 
um, experiencing of fear and separation, and a, a world of individuals in fear and separation. But in truth, there is no such thing. When, when, you're, in, when you're in the position of the light, no such thing as fear and separation can exist. It's only once you're believing you're the character on the screen, mm. then it's like, mm. and you've given that credence, like you've, you've let go of the idea of being in the light. Now you're believing in the cinema screen. Mm -hmm. So now you're cancelling, you're basically you're cancelling the film, which is your karma, which is your belief systems, which then project and then create your experience. And you, you, know, you say, no, I'm, I'm the character, I'm not the light. You know, cause that, but if you cancel the, the projection or the belief system that creates the experiencing of the character, then you return to the infinite, you know, yes. that which is beyond form, beyond separation, beyond shadows, beyond even contrast and different colors and different people and different systems and even fear can't manifest that. So, so I say I cancel my belief in kidney failure I'm an infinite being, and then I, you know, and then it's like, um, the way I do that, um, it's, you know, because I've had white light spiritual experiences, mystical experiences, I know that to be the truth, you know, it's like, and, and as I came out of my white light spirit experience, it's like there was suddenly identification with a thought, and then suddenly that was just enough, and then the whole world came back in to experiencing, mm. and then it's like, so you can see that as soon as I identify with thought, then the whole world can suddenly spring into, into you know, you go, you go off into, it's, there are different levels of the transformer. So as the more you identify with thoughts and body, first you're in like extreme bliss and ecstasy, mm -hmm. and then you identify more with thoughts, mm -hmm. and then you're feeling like a normal person. Then you identify more with thoughts, and then you're in fear and terror. Mm -hmm you see, and then you get all kinds of illnesses and all kinds of bad things happening to you. So just, as you let go of the grip of all your thoughts and feelings, then you start returning to the former state. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. and because I've had that, it's very, very easy, but I, I share that with everyone because it's like, you can, you know, it's just, it's not, these are the, the belief systems or the karma, it's just, it's just a projection that's being held, Ident it's identical, it's got glue. Mm. And, and there is like, mm, it's almost like a decision or a choice. It's maybe an unconscious decision, or and the Course does actually talk about this. Mm. It's an unconscious decision and choice. And then we realize through spiritual work that there is a choice to let it go, to no longer identify or give it power mm. or believe it's real. So I cancel the belief. I refute that this is real. Mm. And I, I, I affirm that I'm an infinite being, beyond fear, separation, beyond even my karmic... Because my karma is, is just creating everything for me. All my belief systems, what comes to me, how much money I've got in the bank, what type of people I bump into, what kind of illnesses are expressing. And also, the, you know, depending on how much I'm holding on, the world becomes a fearful place, an okay place, or a blissful place, or it even goes out of... You know, even the world of fear and separation disappears, depending on that. So, but if you're holding on to something like cancelling belief in cancer or cancelling the belief in pain, back pain, or cancelling the belief in high blood pressure or whatever it is, then you know, you, there's no. I mean, there's absolutely no benefit in holding on to that. So it's very easy to to cancel it. So yeah. you're saying, Sabir, yeah. you know, the I is the small I. Or you're saying basically the I is the infinite I. That cancels. I cancel. When I say I cancel my belief, that I, you're saying that is the infinite I. It's not, it's not the I of the separate self. It's not the ego I. Is that what, that's what you're saying, right? Yeah, I'm, say, I'm saying that. I, th I, think, uh, I think, you know, the intention of doing it will, will invoke the infinite I even if the person doesn't know it. Because, you know, because the belief is mm -hmm. what the small I is trying to hold on to. Yes. No, yeah. I understand that. So, I, I understand. I'm just trying to think we meet the person that kind of, you know, oh, the, the person, sorry, it's not, the, you know, whoever initiates, you know, the I, I can't sell. Yes. 
I can't say. To me, it feels more than it's, it's kind a, of this small eye. eye. Yeah. I, but, uh, I, know, think, I think, I think it, it, the, 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 the system is user-friendly, so it doesn't really matter. No, it doesn't really matter, absolutely. No, yeah. it's just in my head. Well, you know, I say... So it, I no, I think, I'm sure I, it doesn't matter no. in any way at all. No. And it doesn't re reduce its effectiveness in any way. Because, you know, but, yeah, no, yeah. no I, I, think, I think it's about... For, it's an right. advanced, for an advanced seeker, you know, who's not a newcomer, I would position it as the infinite eye. Mm. Because that's going to be faster. You know, because now that you, you know that, you know, so it'd be like... You know, like we say in the Course of Miracles, God is the love in which I forgive. Mm -hmm. So we, we invoke the big I mm -hmm. yeah. to clear. You know, um, so lesson 14, God did not create cancer, so it's not real. So we're invoking the big I yeah, no, to I cancel cancer. Yes, yes, so yes. so if, you, if, you're, if, you're, if you're happy to do that, then when I do the cancelling, then I would invoke, you know, it's my, it's my infinite I is cancelling kidney failure. Yeah, uh, no, I, I, I'm an infinite being sense. subject only to what I hold in mind. Yeah, it's almost you're you're going directly there rather than yeah. yes, no, that's yeah. fine. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah, no, I, I, I get, I get. It makes sense now. Yeah, no, 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 no.